so it's uh, day four into our New York trip. Yeah, it's not like we've been doing nothing but uh, tracing around for four days looking for uh, some great place to eat. But um, we've been doing other things as well, but uh, I guess we have been looking out for uh, a nice place to eat um, during the four days to date and haven't really found anywhere until, well, now. And uh, as often is the case, uh, when you go to new villages, towns, cities, you uh, sometimes uh, just find a place by accident. And such was the case today. So it's uh, the 6th of September and the weather's been great up until now. Um, but with the forecast today of um, thundery showers, it was one of those days we were sort of hanging tight in our plans because, uh, you know, we didn't want uh, to make any wonderful plans and have them to pay to because of bad weather. So uh, after having spent the morning um, up on the uh, top of the rock, we decided we'd uh, head up 56th Street towards Central Park to check out a street where we found some bike hire places to check out for bike hire tomorrow. And we found a bike place and uh, just taking a wander down the street and uh, past this place that just looked like kind of a grocery and Vic said, uh, oh, no, no, let's head in and I'm glad she said that because we've come in and it's a uh, great little find. So um, what's nice about it is that the uh, food is all laid out uh, as you can see down here, nice little open and out shapes. Uh, everything is quite reasonably priced, relatively speaking anyway. Um, and uh, food's really good as well. But what I like most about it is just, it's such a clever and good use of space, this whole layout. So you walk in, you've got the central aisle, with all your sort of, it looks like a grocery shop uh, at first glance, which is why I kind of avoided it initially, because I thought, oh, it's just a grocery shop, but actually it's a hell of a lot more. So yes, you've got all your kind of, mostly grocery items that you want to take away in your centre aisle. Then you come down deep in the shop and there's two little lovely little open L areas here. Uh, first one is salad and you've got those salad boxes laid up on, on top and then you have the uh, hot food over here and then you've got a little pizza place in the corner. You've got more grocery stuff over here and then around the sides you have uh, hot food that's cooked in front of you. And just down here in the side you can just about see I took into some beautiful lentils and with a bread of bread. Uh, Six dollars um, in New York. That's pretty good for a nice kind of filling snack. Um, then the real good bit, I think, is that you can obviously you can take stuff out if you want. You're on the hoof, but if you want to eat in, you go up these stairs, and then you've got these lovely little balconies around the top uh, where you can sit. And just everything about this place is just a fantastic use of space. I and mean, whoever designed this layout. Uh, take a bow because it's not a huge space but such a clever use of the space that's available. I'm looking through here, look, um, as I mentioned, those two little L shaped food areas, people just walking through, nobody's bumping into each other, nobody's getting in his way, and even just the detail of this, the way the, the, the food containers are stacked on top of those kind of glass covers or canopies over where the food is stored. And then you've got the white and black uh, plates for the hot food. Uh, really good find. So this is just off uh, 56th Street. Sorry, it's on 56th Street. Street. Can't even say it. 56th Street. Can't remember if it's east or west. I think it might just be east, but it's off 6th Avenue, between 5th Avenue and 6th Avenue. Sort of Man Manhattan. And uh, I think that's the name of it. Happens to be named. Great find.